Well, since we've had a Grove Bowl since last year's was canceled, but 2021 is on the way. And our first look at what this new addition Ole Miss football team will look like from Vaughn Hemingway Stadium on a rainy afternoon here in Oxford. Uh, we are about to get underway with the 2021 edition of the Grove Bowl. And Matt Corral, even it early, going deep, has a man. It is caught down at the 20-yard line. Braylon Sanders and right out of the gate, a big play for the Rebels. To get some reps here and some kind of live action here in this spring game. To the corner of the end zone. That one is incomplete. Trying to hit Jonathan Mingo this time around. Mingo had three touchdown grabs. Jalen Jordan in excellent position defensively. And a couple of rushes last year. Picked up nine yards. Played just one game. Big strong arm. That one is picked off. Picked off around the 16-yard line on the back end by DeAndre Prince. Handoff goes to Walker. Does he get in? Yes, he does. Will he play receiver? Will he play running back? And he said, hey, we're going to talk about it after the baseball season over and kind of fine-tune where he does. Oh, another interception by the blue team. This one is being returned out to the midfield and finally dropped there. <laughs> right back in the middle, so it was good. And then I, I told him, uh, you got to be able to do it under pressure. And he got up right up on the bump and uh, sent it right down center cut. So it was really good. <laughs> All right, listen, we'll let you go watch some of this. Hey, great job today. Seems like a lot of fun and uh, good luck as you move forward. Thank you. I appreciate it. John Rice Plumley joining us after a baseball team rallies from down 9-1 in the eighth inning. And look at the celebration after Sanders <laughs> with the touchdown reception from Matt Corral. You hear the term cross training quite a bit now in the college football world. Corral slings it toward the end zone and is caught. Jonathan Mingo off the deflection. Boy, the red team felt like there was a jump. There was no flag and they're jumping up and down. <laughs> Walker gets the touchdown. <laughs> Working on the drop eight, getting all those looks. Uh, drop eight isn't, isn't unfamiliar to me anymore. And uh, one, it made me a better leader. You know, regardless of regardless of circumstance, <laughs> don't go too high, don't go too low. And you know, my teammates. It's fun, no doubt, and uh, it's always fun to play in the, the SC championship game and actually win it. Yeah, I mean, a lot of teams have gotten there. They just haven't won it. And, you know, Ole Miss, DJ, don't forget, remember when uh, Hugh Freeze five years ago maybe, I forget what it was, they were just one play. See what they do here on a first and goal from the two, the freshman Luke Altmeyer oh, gets man. the snap. Pressure came in a hurry, the quick slant over the middle, and that pass is caught. <laughs> Jonathan Hess. There will be no shutout in the Grove Bowl. And he booted it about 40 yards into the stands after the after the touchdown. <laughs> they say there's no fun going on. <laughs> Back around with the fire extinguisher. <laughs> well, they're going to call it a game after that touchdown despite what was left on the clock. And what a way to end it. Everybody with smiles on their face after the touchdown reception.